morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys. Wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. For the newcomers, my name is Vidi. I hold some bitcoins. And yes, yesterday I said it will be the last video on the rooftop terrace. No, today is the last video because today we are going to move. So I'm going to make a short video because I need to start moving over the stuff because I need to check out a tent here in this house. Hmm cool charts on this beautiful saturday morning guys let's quickly jump into the charts bam cause the devil was on my train i've been running so long that my feet don't work no more Um, we have the four hour chart like you're used and the four hour chart I've been saying for days to you guys or weeks we need to break that green box look what we just did we went into that green box and now we need to keep and stay in this green box we are trying to break the 42k level we are falling back a little bit on the four hour chart to 41,500 but we need to break that 42k level and I will show you in the next chart why but this is very positive to see guys check here bam over here these two areas are really important at the moment so at the moment we have the support around 30k here uh, a little bit higher 30k did he something like that and we have the resistance now at 42k and why look because we were resisted over there we found resistance but then we broke it over there then resistance turned into support over there you know and then here again we broke that area and then it again became some resistance so now this needs to be broken if we break this to the upside for example like this and then we come back and retest it and then go up that would be an amazing bitcoin parabolic move because that would mean we we turn the resistance into support it is pretty green on this day chart the bam bam is pointing up we crossed already over here this was the buying signal yes the proof is over there if i show it to you you can still see it um yeah there this was the long flag the bam bam was indicating that we closed above the yellow stepping line there was a green dot there was a lot of huge green area here we crossed the bam and of course we can see the rsi breaking out here at the bottom exactly like we said we have we're seeing this if we break out it will be a huge move guys this is now how many day candles in the row that is green the 21st 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 almost is it good 2 3 4 5 6 Eight, nine, 11 days green that's a huge amount of green days in a row check if you look back to this part that was when we had so many green candles as well so really positive let's check um, how all the other charts are now playing out that we have been speaking about the last weeks bam here this is that beautiful EMA ribbon that we talked about and yes we saw support we saw we told you got huge wicks to the bottom means that we are going to turn around the market this is on the, the chart you can see the candle is now at 38,600 at the moment like we saw here the price is at 41,800 so if this candle would be edited then it would be now in this area there 41 and that would mean that if this green candle is going to close this is the weekly chart if this one is going to close above this yellow line here that would be awesome because then we are breaking out of that EMA ribbon and then the next candle will start above that EMA ribbon this chart is going to close in one day and 18 hours if we if we can manage to do this and make a new candle open above this level we will target this yellow level at 45k really cool bam Gaussian channel check what have we been talking about lately we must not be sucked to the bottom of this channel 24k that everybody was expecting but we need to break that midline and what are we doing at the moment this is a five day chart every candle is five days guys be aware we broke the midline with the five day candle of the 25th we are opening 
this one, this one still has like almost four days to go. And that one is above that midline. Now the target should be the top of that midline at 45k. If we are able to get out of this beautiful Gaussian channel on the five day chart, that is very positive. And why? Because if we zoom out, we need to understand as well the negative side of this Gaussian channel because this 45k is a huge resistance. The last time we did this kind of move over here, for example, uh, over here, for example, here, this is the last time we came down, we went up the Gaussian channel, we broke it, and then we went to the top of that Gaussian channel at 10k at that moment. And because we didn't break the top, we fell down even below the Gaussian channel, all the way back to that beautiful area of 3k where we bought a shitload of bitcoins again. So we need to break that. The moment you do this and we break the top, then we go up, we retest the Gaussian channel, and then you get a parabolic move. So that is what I hope. Break it, retest it, parabolic move all the way up to 100k at the end of the year. All beautiful, all looking beautiful, bam. Here, uh, I don't know if you remember this one, the one, two, three, four, five. I said we are missing a wa uh, one wave, the fifth wave. Um, I found this chart like weeks ago, I think on Bitcoin Jack's Twitter. Yeah, I think Bitcoin Jacks, and I tried to remake that chart just to show, you know, if it works, and it is working. Check. We had the fourth wave, and we are getting the fifth wave. Look, those candles are going up. They are not going down. They are going up. So we need to break this area of resistance now. Then that area of resistance, bam, to take the fifth wave all the way up above 160k. Bam, another chart. My God, did he? Saturday charting day? Yes, because we were looking at the Bitcoin energy value and we told you guys every time when the energy value during a bull run, this is, oh, sorry guys, this is a 2017 bull run here, when the energy value drops tremendously and then picks up again, we get a huge run in the price. Here, when the energy value here in March 2017 drops tremendously, it picks up again and then you get a huge bull run now what did we see during this bull run look just normal movements and now this energy dropped in may tremendously and now it's picking up again tremendously i will draw again tremendously picking up again tremendously picking up again so now tell me what you think that that is going to do with the price I think that will make the price go up tremendously, like that. And if you look to the bottom of this beautiful indicator, then you can see, of course, here, look, this is the bull run, and when it starts to go down and pick up, pick up, and pick up, higher peaks, higher peaks, you get to the top, look what is happening over here now, again, the same, you went down, higher peaks, higher peaks, and I think we are going to go to and the same like that. And that is what we see on the charts, guys. Bam, last chart, not the worst chart, because this chart I drew a long time ago. And um, on this chart, you can see that, um, I'm going to put my face over there, guys. I told you guys, I compared those bearish crosses, those death crosses. And I told you guys, at the moment we saw that death cross here in April or March, the price of Bitcoin was already growing up. I, I, I made those steps, you know. We saw the dead cross on the 26th of March. The cross, I told you guys, was lagging behind. The crash of 8th of March. Number two, the moment the dead cross happened, we already were going up in price. And then it took a long time, about 57 bars, to make the golden cross, the green line crossing that red line. And then I said, now we can see the same. We had the crash on the 10th of May. Then we got the dead cross here at this moment, 21st of June. At that moment, the Bitcoin price was already going up and it's still going up, guys, like you can see. And now the green line starts to turn up. If we would in 57 days again create a golden cross, then that would be on the 16th of August. So if this green line is going up here to the 16th of August, breaking that red line, we again get that golden cross. That is how these crosses work. I hope you understand this. If not, pause the video and just uh, watch it again. I will put my face here so you can pause the video and...
bam that was enough time for pausing hope you really enjoyed today's video if you did enjoy today's short video from this amazing place last day really last day then give the video a thumbs up share it with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and please leave a comment as i love to respond to your comments and yes my eyes are a little bit small because i had a drink yesterday with my good brother-in-law here at the bar that was a small party and, and we really enjoyed it because now we are going to live the farmer life with goats sheep chickens in the middle of nowhere between billionaires and camps so <laughs> i hope you really enjoyed yesterday's video as well where i showed you that house and um, if not do watch that video because i spend a lot of time in creating this beautiful family video as well and um, thanks for watching i wish you an amazing day maybe join the dutch ama later today in the new house or the english one tomorrow also in the new house so i will give you the tour to mikasa thanks for watching guys and see you later bye